table should look something like this, where you have the time, T1, kit flux, T1 mean, and delta T. We're going to plot delta T versus T1 mean. Now, we will calculate E1, which is the energy received by the reflector, and E4, which is the sensible heat gain. E1 is given by the projector area of the reflector times the radiation intensity. E4 is given by the specific heat of copper times the mass times the difference in temperature over the time. Now, assuming a radiation intensity of 906 watt per meter square, the energy received by the reflector will be 0.24 meters squares times 906 watts per meter square will be equals to 217.44 watts. Assuming a difference of temperature of 6.6 .6 Kelvin, E4, which is the sensible heat gain, will be equals to 419 joules per kilogram Kelvin times 2.84 kilograms times 6.6 .6 Kelvins over 60 seconds which is equals to 130.89. The efficiency is given by E4 over E1, which in this case will be approximately to 60%. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.